What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV. In this video, I'm going to tell you about my new most annoying bug, at least that I've encountered and that seems to be, I hope it's a bug. I hope it's not just actual hardware. How about the Galaxy Z Fold 3? There's things that I've been complaining about for a while, but I still use it as my daily driving phone because of this massive, beautiful display. The cameras bug me. Um, then, you know, they're just okay. The battery life is awful for me. I know some of you are going to be feeling differently about that. But I have a new one, and this just seemed to, it, it's always been a slight annoyance, but now it's a big annoyance. And I think it came with the One UI uh, 4 slash Android 12 update that's been pushed to it. I'm currently on the January update of this, so I have the latest update that's available from Samsung for the Galaxy Z Fold 3. And again, let's just jump right into it. And it might be hard to replicate, but it, uh, throughout the day, it affects me. So again, it's kind of hard to just replicate, but basically it's the auto rotation, meaning that when you rotate the screen, which I think I have it turned off there, but, and I turned it off on the home screen because it was giving me issues. But basically when you hold the phone like that, it rotates and then it rotates back. That's what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to be as easy as that. And it's supposed to work just like that. But I've noticed and encountered from these, since these updates of launch where it, like literally we get stuck in this orientation, I'll be in this orientation watching a video or something or looking at a website or on the Google Play Store and I'll want to go back to this orientation and it just will not go back to that orientation. I don't know if any of you are encountering this and it gets to a point where I'm like, my God, and like I'm literally going like this. It's, well, not that fast, but like back and forth. I'd be like, come on, switch back, switch back. You're taking forever. It'll literally not happen at all. I'll have to do it like five or six times in order for it to set back to go back. And I don't know, it's like sometimes it's too sensitive in terms of it flipping. Sometimes it's not sensitive enough. But anyways, it's like the most annoying thing to me since the update has come out for Android 12. That's seemingly where it just got worse and worse and worse. And I haven't searched anything to see if it's a common issue with most people. So that's why I'm kind of bringing it up in case you guys are affected by this issue as well, because I'm deeply affected. I notice a lot, again, when just watching videos and stuff, I'll bring my YouTube up and just kind of see if it happens along here. But it happens so much, it's so annoying. You just pick a video, for instance, let's pick this one. What is going on, oh, guys? I don't need to hear my voice, but let's turn it. And you can watch it, you know, beautiful, and I'll switch it back. It's switching back. It's working great in here. I don't know what it is. Like when you put this thing to the test, like, look at the camera. It's going to get you. It, it works perfectly. But when it's just me and this little baby phone or big boy phone, and I'm walking or in my house or whatever I'm doing, it gets stuck. In, and it's always in, stuck in this orientation. It never gets stuck in portrait mode. It's always stuck in the horizontal mode. And it's freaking annoying. So I, I want to know if you guys having the same issue because it's now my... Probably, I st battery life is still a pain in the butt. It's still my number one worst annoyance with this phone, but the the auto rotation uh, of it, because I love using auto rotate. I don't want to use just portrait mode anyway. I know you can just set it to that. Uh, but yeah, let me know about you guys if you had that issue and if you have found a fix for it, or if you're just having the issue and you don't have a fix, let me know in the comments down below. There you guys go. Have a great day and we'll see you down the road. Peace.